The JBL Live Pro 2 has multi-point connection, which is one of my favorite features on these JBL earbuds, but they don't really teach you how to connect it to do two different devices. So I'm gonna teach you how to do that in today's video. I'm Adrian with Ardently Tech. With multi-point connection, you can only choose two products. For this demonstration, I'm going to connect it to my iPhone and an iPad. You can connect it to your phone and to another phone or to your phone and then to your laptop, which again is another great option. For any of the other products, you just gotta know how to get to your Bluetooth settings basically. First step is put them, like take them out of the case and put them in your ear. If they're brand new, they'll be already pairing and waiting for you to pair them to a device. But if you already have something connected and you wanna connect it to something new, all you gotta do is just double tap and hold until you hear pairing. And once you do that, you go to the first device that you want to pair it to. For this instance, again, I am connecting to my iPhone. So you go to iPhone settings, you go to Bluetooth, and you wait for the uh, JBL Live Pro 2s to show up. And once they do, click on them and they will pair. And you'll hear connected. Now once you do that, you're connected to your first device. To get connected to your second device is just basically to repeat that process. You double tap and hold on the same earbud and you wait for the pairing mode to turn on. And then you go to your tablet or whatever. You go to Bluetooth settings, uh, look for the JBL Live Pro 2s, click them, and then you'll hear connected. Now you should be able to switch between the two of the devices seamlessly. I have no issues when I do it with my tablet to my iPhone or when I go from my work phone and my personal phone. Now if you wanted to um, drop the connections and you go do it something else, you just repeat the process. Double tap hold, connect to another device, easy as that. I don't know which one gets dropped if it's the first device or the second device, but you'll just have to play around with that a little bit more. Now, if you were to put your earbuds away and put them back in, you should hear connected twice connected. Connected. Um, if you're near your two products that you're connected to. It's not gonna reflect in the app like it does with the Sony WH-1000MX4s and that app, the Sony app. You'll still have the access to the JBL app to do any customization when it comes to the equalizer settings or anything like that. And this might be a similar process for any JBL earbud that has multi-point connection or headset, even beyond JBL probably. If the earbud or headset that you, you have has multi-point connection capabilities, it might be a similar setup. If you found today's video helpful, make sure to leave a like to let us know and subscribe to our channel for more videos like this. If you have any more questions and concerns or if you're having any more trouble, leave them in the comments below. I am not JBL tech support by any means, but I'll try to help uh, the best that I can from the experiences that I've experienced. So if you enjoyed this video, you might enjoy the full review that I did on the JBL Live Pro 2s right here or any of the other reviews that we've done on our channel. We'll see you in the next video. Peace.